Good morning. A Brookville man is scheduled to appear in Cook County Court this afternoon. Chicago police arrested the 37-year-old shortly after the shooting in Garfield Park. One of the victims was a 12-year-old boy. His family says that he was shot in the back and he is struggling to walk. Police say Adam Avesius was identified as the shooter. Prosecutors charge him with one felony count, battery discharge of a firearm. Police say Avesius opened fire outside Legler Library Branch on Pulaski near Wilcox Street at about 5.30 Tuesday evening. The 12 year old shot near his was shot near his spine. The 16 year old boy was shot in his legs. The younger boy's family says he attends the nearby Melody Stem Elementary School and goes to the library every day to do his homework and to participate in after school programs. He had stepped outside to eat a snack when he was shot. In response to the shooting, community activists and members of the newly formed Harrison Police District Council stood outside the library Thursday to show solidarity. They highlighted what they have done to try to curb gun violence in the community. They asked residents to come forward with their ideas. We are saying that, as we've been saying, that it is not okay. We will not allow this. We will continue to organize. It's numerous things that are happening in community. Um, so we have to be patient with ourselves, yet intentional in being able to address these issues. And it's not just on us as residents, though we are organized and we are going to do more than our part. Now, police have not revealed who the suspect may have been targeting in this incident. We expect we may learn more about that from prosecutors when the suspect appears in court. Outside CPD headquarters at 35th in Michigan, Judy Wang, WGN News.